All right, let's shift our focus to something interesting that is going to be happening in the Supreme Court today. Now, remember, the center in an affidavit had asked the Supreme Court to regulate digital media first before regulating the electronic media. The center was responding to the Supreme Court, which earlier this week, while hearing a case of a TV channel vilifying a particular community, talked about the need for a regulation of electronic media. The judges called for a panel of five distinguished citizens to come up with standards for electronic media and was to take up the case again today. Now, the center has asked the Supreme Court to regulate first the dig digital media and not electronic, saying that digital media has a faster reach and potential to become viral due to apps like WhatsApp and Facebook. They said there is sufficient framework and judgments on electronic and print media. Vaidya Nathan joining us for more on this. Vaidya, what can we expect as the case is heard today? See, expectations, I can't suggest or uh, forecast anything. As far as the court is concerned, it is supposed to pass orders appointing five eminent persons in the panel to set up and suggest standards for the electronic media. So now, center is completely opposed to saying that already there is a statute and other laws and even Supreme Court judgments are there to control the electronic media for print media there is separate set of uh, uh, authority is there so why to do it first but, but first you take up the digital media in fact during the last hearing itself uh, solicitor general tushar mehta made it clear digital media is more important because some fake news are even referred to the covid lockdown where some fake news because of that people started leaving the cities so he said first you take up that and he said as for the uh, electronic media, it's kind of a one-time news, whereas the digital media, it's being often repeated and goes viral. So as for the news broadcasters association is concerned, it's also indirectly opposed, saying that we have an authority. Not only that, even INB, INB ministry can cancel the license of a television channel. And interestingly, it also said that already there is a case pending before the chief justice bench with regard to Nizamuddin, that Marcus issue, where the petition Jamaiti Ulma has said that uh, fake news is being propagated, there should be some control. So that issue is already pending, so why to take up this now? Anyway, it's for the three-judge bench headed by Justice Dr. D.O. Chandra to decide what to do further.